Hi everyone, this is James and I am so excited to prepare this lesson for you. I want to begin by first thanking you for choosing to watch this video tutorial. In this lesson, we will talk about Archicon settings for a beginner to help us get started with our project. And just to mention to you that uh, this lesson is part of what I am calling Archicad Basics series. They are a series of lessons that teach you from the very basic settings up to developing your house project, 3D and 2D modeling, up to saving your drawing as a PDF for printing. And so, if you are ready, we are going to, po uh, to follow five st steps. And the first step is to open our Archicad program. You, as you can see, my Archicad program is already open. So I will go to number option step number two, which is create a new project. So create a new project, select this option, and leave the other settings as they are, and and click on OK. Now when Archicad opens, it displays an empty workspace with the four elevation viewpoints. This is the Archicad uh, workspace and these are the elevation viewpoints that are set by default when you open your Archicad program. Now before we get started on working uh, on our project, for this lesson we will do a few settings, then we will end our lesson, and lesson 2 we will start creating our walls to start building our project. So, there are three settings that we are supposed to do. And the first one it is to set our working units. So up here, go to Options, Project Preferences, and select Working Units. Now, depending on the country you come from, uh, uh, there are <coughs> there are a lot of there are options for the units that we can use to work with. So and and, and I am used with I mean, I am used to working uh, with the millimeters. So I will select a millimeter for my length, and for the angle I will use decimal degrees. You can choose the others if you are conversant with working with those. So then I will click on OK. Now the other setting that you are supposed to do is the dimensioning units. So I will go to Options, Project Preferences and Dimensions. And now that I chose to work with the millimeters for my units, I will also use millimeters, this one, my dimensions. So I'll select here millimeter and click OK. And that is, is set. Now the last settings that we are going to do is the story settings. And that one is found here. You can see where my cursor is moving. The, to the right bottom of your screen. So click on settings. And this is where you can either insert or delete a story. So for example, if I wanted to insert another floor above the ground floor, I will click on insert above. If I wanted to insert another floor below the ground floor, I will click on insert below. And if I wanted to delete one of those floors, I will click on it to alight it, then I will click 
lead story I will light this and click lead story then for me I don't want to add or delete any of the flows so that is set for me and uh, for the height from one flow to the other I want to use 3000 millimeter which is equivalent to 3 meters and that is what is already preset here for me so I will click OK so that is the settings that we were supposed to do and that marks the end of lesson 1 and I am requesting you to subscribe to this YouTube channel so that you will be notified when uh, I upload the next lesson. Thanks for watching.